What's going on YouTube? This is your boy Sigma here bringing you another gameplay commentary for the Wii and for Black Ops again. And this is going to be a little short and sweet commentary. You know, we go beast mode on these guys' asses. We beat them in less than three minutes. Nah, just kidding. We don't beat them in three minutes. We beat them in three minutes because of host migration fails, alright? Like, you'll see at the end of this gameplay that my score is started off just amazing in this game and I'm gonna use the M16 good old flak jacket sleight of hand and marathon you know I just love my unlimited sprint so I'm gonna always put marathon on except for an LMG cause LMG is slow as fuck there's no point in like wasting ma having marathon when you can have like tack mask or some other helpful perk for perk 3 maybe second chance pro and be a troll I don't know but uh anyways in this game I start off and I just go on a freaking tear on these guys. That guy right there, he should have killed me. I don't know how he, uh, he just failed miserably. And then the M16 with the silencer is just fucking amazing on this game. It it was my favorite gun for like the first three or four prestige on this game. And and then I discovered the AUG with the reflex sight and said, oh my gosh, this gun is fucking amazing. And then I learned it was cheap and I was like, uh, that's why it's amazing because it's so damn good. And, uh, but you know what? I really, I really stopped caring about if a gun is cheap or not, but... You know what I'm gonna say? This is this is a, an example of why we need toast migration, and maybe maybe that's why I'm I'm thinking maybe they should wait for Black Ops 2 and just put that on Wii U, because I'm pretty sure Wii U will have the same kind of online system. I don't know a lot of details about its online capacity, but I'm pretty sure it's online is gonna be just like PS3 and Xbox, where you ha you can get that host migration, you get enough power to have you know those HD graphics already. We know we're gonna get those, and if they have the same online system with the gamer tag or whatnot, or you know a login name or whatever and uh, you should be able to have post migration and hopefully we'll get it so this kind of crap doesn't happen because you know when you when you're getting a score like this the host will quit you know when you when you're just destroying them completely and I think the host is on my team if I'm not mistaken when the scoreboard pulls up at the end I'm pretty sure he was on my team and just didn't spawn or something like that because the you know there, there was lag host lag with the frame rate that never got fixed and I think they might have fixed it partially in Final Warfare 3 but it's still shitty and it's annoying to play with. Yeah, you get perfect hit detection, but yeah, you get frame rate that's absolutely poopy. So most of the time, you know, the host is going to want to quit because they can't deal with this lag sometimes. Well, a lot of the time, actually, they, they do that. But, oh, here it is. Look at that. Look at that M16 bullet penetration. Nothing. And get up. Oh, connection interrupted. Best thing to see. 16 to 0, guys. The host is on my team. and He just didn't want to play. 16 to freaking 0 in two minutes and the host quits. You see why we need host migration? You see? 